In this video, we will show you how to use and work with the MultiView Local Zoom Text Multiple Monitor Mode. If you haven't already, we recommend viewing the Configuring Your Multiple Monitor System with Zoom Text video. Before we begin, all of the multiple monitor modes can be accessed by clicking on the Type button on the Zoom Text toolbar or from the Magnifier menu by pressing Alt-M and choosing Zoom Windows or pressing Z. Multi-view local is one of the new innovative display modes available in Zoom Text 10.1. With multi-view local, each monitor displays a magnified view of a discrete desktop. In other words, monitor 1 displays a magnified view of only the content appearing on desktop 1, and monitor 2 displays a separate magnified view of only the content appearing on desktop 2, and so on. This is ideal for the typical use of two or more monitors, where you are viewing a different application on each desktop and want to see both at the same time. When using MultiView Local, only one screen is active at a time, and the mouse pointer is constrained to the active screen, but can be switched to the other display by pressing Control Q. You can also simply move your mouse pointer across the screen border to move to the next desktop. While the pointer may resist moving across the border, pressing against the border for a couple of seconds or double tapping the border with the mouse will allow the pointer to move to the next desktop. A sound cue will also play informing you when you cross over into the next desktop. Any changes you make to zoom text will only affect the current display you are on. This lets you set individual magnification levels or even enhancements for each display. To use this mode most effectively, open the application you wish to use on your current display, then press Ctrl Q or move your mouse past the border onto the other desktop. Now open a different application. Notice that this will not open on top of the application you opened on the other desktop. MultiView Local allows you to easily multitask and view separate applications at any given time. There are a number of settings you can customize for MultiView Local by accessing the Multiple Monitor Options dialog. To do this, click the Type button and click Settings, or open the Magnifier menu by pressing Alt-M and choosing Zoom Windows or pressing Z. Now, click the Multiple Monitor Options button or press Alt-M. On this dialog, you'll find checkboxes to allow you to change various settings. Access these using the mouse or on the keyboard by using the tab key to navigate to each control and the spacebar to check or uncheck the option. The first option at the top allows you to keep the mouse pointer from crossing the border for a set number of seconds, meaning you will have to keep pushing the mouse for that period of time before it crosses over. The next option lets you choose whether or not you want a border displayed across the desktops, and following this is a checkbox to enable sound cues, and combo box to choose one of four sound cue sets as well as their volume. There is also a checkbox to lock the magnification level across the displays. Lastly, earlier we mentioned how you can set enhancements independently as well. At the bottom of this dialog, there is a combo box to choose where to show the screen enhancements. Either click or press Alt-E to access this control. You can choose to have the enhancements displayed on all displays, the main display, or extended displays. The new multiple monitor support is now available as a free update in all versions of Zoom Text 10.1, including Zoom Text Magnifier, Magnifier Reader, and Fusion. For more information, go to www zoomtext.com or call us at 800-859-0270. Be sure to check our website for more videos on how to use this exciting new feature.